the idea behind this exhibition for luck came about when I purchased a book on eBay, I think it was from 1810, um, about mechanical parts and machine parts. It was full of four-leaf clovers, pressed four-leaf clovers. So I guess that got me thinking about the rituals surrounding luck in relation to natural materials. So there's one which apparently it's lucky to keep an acorn in your pocket. If an eyelash falls out, you put it on the back of your hand and then you toss it over your shoulder. Just the blowing of a dandelion head and collecting the thistle seeds which are in the hair net behind me. Um, and lucky bamboo, of course. I guess a lot of the things in the show haven't been sort of wished on, you know, so it's sort of this anticipation of luck. So usually my work responds directly to architectural space, um, often some sort of issue I have with the space. So in this case, it was the lift and the, the doors over there. So I made a work which focuses directly into this corner. The tiles are sort of a stage for these carefully selected objects, which I'm placing a lot of importance on each of these things because of the rituals associated with them to do with luck. So I've got elements of things which directly reference the idea of bathrooms, the bath mat, the towels, the hair net. You know, there's things that talk about bodily residue, like the eyelashes, obviously, um, and the plug hole sort of talks about washing away. You know, I certainly would be excited if I found a four-leaf clover. And I do occasionally blow a dandelion head and make a wish. Um, but I don't know if I really believe in it, which I guess that ties into the fact that all these things are unwished.